Okay, so here is the latest tank, a 20-gallon long-profile tank currently undergoing a CAT scan. Say hi, Moonroof. The... She's everywhere I want to be. She's like the Visa card. Water flows around the edge of this end of the uh, two-inch diameter or so acrylic tube through a wad of polyester cotton filter batting. And then along the length of the heater, which is immersed in immersed inside of the tube. The tube is wide enough to allow the heater to warm up the water that flows over it without letting the heater uh, actually come into contact with the plastic. At the far end, drawing suction on all this is, you can almost see it in there, this is a, uh, a fountain pump, a small, a small capacity fountain pump. It's drawing suction on this soda bottle. This is the soda bottle. The neck end of which is stuck in to make fairly firm contact with the heat exchanger acrylic tube. Because the pump is drawing suction again through more filter uh, polyester filter batting because the pump is drawing suction on this bottle and because the bottle is fairly well snug up against the base of this two inch acrylic tube that is the heat exchanger the inlet is exclusively let's see if I can go to this end is exclusively through that end of the uh, of the tube. Water flows along the heater, goes into the soda bottle through more batting, and then is discharged through a hole in, in the bottom of the, uh, of the soda bottle through which exits the discharge tube, a half inch diameter tube, it goes through a jerry-rigged filter and down into what would conventionally be used as an under gravel filter. The undergravel filter in this case, however, which runs the entire length and breadth of the tank, is being used as the discharge for the heater, so that the heat coming, the warmed water coming out of the heat exchanger and then pumped by the pump, filters up through the gravel. Again, the undergravel filter is being used as a discharge, not an intake. So warm water flows out through the gravel. It is my contention that this will enable the, the warm water to thoroughly warm the gravel, which would normally be at a much colder temperature than the rest of the tank, especially during winter months. Thank you for watching.